<coughs> Hello, everybody. Happy Friday. Doggy. That's Dawn in the background. Hacking. She is feeling a little bit better, though. Doesn't sound like it, but she is. Let me say some howdy. Amel Pataya. 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 Welcome, welcome, welcome. David Cox is in the house. Listra's here. Hello, Listra. Happy Friday. Thank God it's Friday. Yes. Mercelin's here. Mercelin, hello. Always smile. Every time I say commercial, she makes me smile. Um, Milka Grumore, Gamora. Hope I said that right. Welcome. Tim Mills. David Roloski. David, what's happening? Hey, hey, hey. What's up? David Otto. I'm glad you can make it, David. A lot of David's here today. Leanne Bonnet, thanks for everything you do. <coughs> Karen Whitman is here. Vanessa D. Karina Lance. Hello, Karina. Make sure I give a shout out to Karina. Uh, Amanda Sins. Sinis. Sins. Welcome. Johnny Simmons. Hello, Johnny. Angela Lynn. Welcome, welcome, welcome. David, the fisherman angelic is in the house. Howdy. Roy McAfee, what's happening? Glad you could make it. Yes, happy Friday to you too. It's been a wild week. It's been a wild last few weeks, actually. That's what keeps me going. Even if you're under the weather. On passive is the best aspirin in the planet. Um, Pat Parent, you're a superstar. You know that. Mo All the women of On Passive are superstars. I'm not kidding. The guys are pretty good, but the women, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry. I don't know. John Barella, you're pretty good too, buddy. How you doing, John? Man, my phone is on fire right now. Anyway, um, I'm getting well. I'm still dealing with vocal issues. <coughs> I heard you sing, John. Your vocals weren't all that great. But I give you A for effort because you do not care, which is pretty cool. You did it. You sang in front of everybody. Uh, Donna Hamlin, how you doing? I'm glad you could be here. Happy Friday to you, too. Uh, we're cooking on down. Pitmata's here. Hello, Pitmata. Glad you could make it. Scotty Kelly's always here. Scotty, what's happening? Another fine week. Thank you very much, Scotty. I'm glad you, uh, I think I did a good job. I appreciate that. I try to do the best I can. Speaking of good jobs, Tanya Ambassador is here. She is a, uh, she's phenomenal. She helps me a, a lot. We have over 20, 21,000 people in on Passive uh, Nation group right now. And uh, it's a really nice group. A really nice group. And it's because of the women that run it. It's obviously not me. I try, but I don't I don't have a lot of time. But Tanya and the other women run it like a ship. Like the ship that it is. Janet Muller, how you doing? Glad you can make it. Joanne Lingner. Karen Monsies is here. Hello, Karen. Stephen Dwell. Steve, how you doing, buddy? Raphael is in the house from the Bahamas. He's a great leader. He helps everyone. They got an outstanding group. 
in the Bahamas, by the way. Outstanding group. Every Aravind, Aravind Rapari. Welcome. And I'm sorry for bashing your name, but I did the best I could. I'm passing for all. Boom. Tim, the Dylan Leprechaun, Captain Kirk is in the house. How you doing, Tim? I hope you're doing great. <coughs> Barbara Ann Johnson's been here forever. We're feeling better. It's just, uh, you know, when you got grandkids living with you, they're like little Petri dishes. You know what I mean? They collect things and bring it home to Pop Pop and Mimi. Here you go, guys. Thank you. Here's a cold for you. Here's a little virus for you. Yeah. John Roxon, how you doing, buddy? I wish you guys would say where you're from. That would be cool. Zombie guy, what's up? Seriocho, my man. He's an energized guy, too. He does a lot for everybody. Sorry, I, I appreciate everything you do. M, M. Kylie, welcome. Prosper Abba's in the house. <coughs> <coughs> Randall Harris, how you doing? Let me see what we got. Uh-oh, it just jumped down, so I'm sure. Per per Perpetua Zephyrin. Donna Hamlin, Robert Tantulo, Rupa Paul, hello, Ruth Pace, Juanita Ali, Elsie Patch, hello, Elsie, Mike Davey, Keith Morris, Casey Zevenbergen, there he is, Akram's in the house. Hello, Akram, from Bangladesh. Great group you guys got. You got a huge group. Michael Barrow, how you doing, buddy? You don't have to call me leadership counsel. I don't. That's nothing. Uh, Stephen Woodley, senior, welcome. Bermuda is in the house. Keith Morris, how you doing? Uh, we're cooking. I'm going back up backwards. There's the peacock, Julie. Julie's in the house. Hello, hello. Hello to your daughter, too. The miniature peacock. Anyway, I hope you're feeling better, Julie. Thanks for everything. Hey, Julie, Ash did not write me back yet. Let's just start a new list. So anything that you added from the first list, take it off and put it on the new one, please, just so we don't get them together. If you don't mind, I know it's a lot of work, but if you can, and then Sunday night we'll hand in a brand new one because I've got more. He's unless Anyway, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, Julie helps me like you wouldn't believe. Uh, Myra Aquino, she does 99% of the work, actually. Jean Oliva is in the house. Hello, Jean. Thanks for everything you do. James Yates is here. Oh, I'm still going backwards. Belinda Allen. Hello. Glad you could make it. Patrick McGuigan, my man, my man. What a what a big hearted guy. Patrick, you're very very inspirational, buddy. Lister, you know you're a powerhouse. I still think when you guys get okay, you and your sister should uh do some lives together. Uh Santosh Kumar, how you doing? Nick King is in the house. If you want something done, ask a woman. You're, you're right. Joe Weisler. 
Whistler from Labrador. Wow. Hello, Joe. Glad you could make it. Ying Yang 444. Hello, buddy. Lynn Nakamoto's in the house. Another lady works like a maniac. Janet Butler, the sharp lady from where? Bahamas. I got your email, Janet. I'll I'll get that in there. We'll try to get that fixed. I got hundreds of emails, by the way. Abu Ro Rock Rock Rahan. Hope that's right from Bangladesh. Welcome. Eric Kessler. There you are, Eric. I figured I'd find you in here somewhere. Santos Kumar, Christina Dodds. I think I said it. Roy Davies, Kathy Burt, Bergeron. <coughs> Can I get some prayers for my granddaughter in there to be safe? Leaving for Kenya? Absolutely. She needs prayers for her daughter going to Kenya. Leanne Bonnet. Stephen Woodley Sr., how you doing from Bermuda? Obed Goody, Arkansas, in the house. Uh, have I got everybody? Tarlin Kumar. Rob Gorman. Rob, what's up? God bless you, Rob. God bless you, Rob. He knows what I'm talking about. He knows exactly what I'm talking about. He's got that little drill sergeant he's married to. <laughs> uh, Kenneth Donnelly. Hello. Allison Bryden. We're up to 198 people. I hope I didn't miss anybody. This thing jumps down. Marie Lobasimo. Dale Cruz is here. Hello. <coughs> Debbie Morgan. Hello. I know I missed you the first time. Fortune Moyo. <coughs> James Nyberg. Welcome. Anyway, hopefully I didn't miss you. I probably did. Let me go all the way to the bottom. Mr. Me. Oh. Bobby Tear, <coughs> the dancer, he told me how to pronounce his name. I got to go read. I got to go make sure I do it right before I say it. Sean Cyrus, what's up? You thought you were done with the military. Well, I don't think so. Bob Heinz, what's up? Emmanuel, get you. Anyway, Yvonne Finn, Sean Cyrus, Robert Oates. Oh, my gosh. <coughs> anyway, let me, uh, let me kind of do a... Um, Week in review profile, please go into your profile when you log in. Right hand side, your picture on the top right. If it's not a picture, it's probably an avatar. Click on it, go to your profile, make sure everything in there is correct your name, your telephone number. Uh, no plus signs, doesn't work, and make sure it's right. And then push save. People registering. For the first time, if your first name is one letter, it will work now. It didn't before. It had to be a minimum of three. Now, uh, obviously, Mr. Mufaro tested me, Red, and Chris, and we failed. If your name is Chris, you put Chris. You don't put C. Okay? You put your full name. But if you happen to have a first name that is one letter, which I don't know anybody with one letter, but it could be, or two letters, you can do that now. You couldn't before. 
Now, as far as the telephone number, what was kicking people out was putting the plus sign for a country, plus something, plus one, plus two, whatever. No plus sign, just numbers. That's all you need is just numbers. In fact, if you put a plus sign in now, red, red letters underneath will say numbers only because I tested it to make sure. That's how it works. If you have an issue with unpassive, uh, put a support ticket in. And if you do, if you could take a uh, screenshot or whatever, do it. Now, keep it simple. I need to do this because this. No big, long story. They don't have time to read it. They have to be able to solve your problem without asking you a question. So if you send them something and they have to question you on it, it's not going to work. Like I've had people send stuff to me, believe it or not. I can't log in. That's it. And I'm like, why not? I don't know. You have to tell me. I... Whatever, you have to give a little bit of an explanation, but not too much. I signed up last January underneath my friend John. It didn't go to John. It went to someone else. I would like to put my uncle. My other uncle told me I could say, no, 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 just the problem, how to solve it. Very clear, very, very clear. Please, if you can't log in, then you're not going to be able to give a support ticket. You can write support at support at ofounders with an S dot net and explain to you the same thing. Support at ofounders dot net. I'm going to put that in the window. Okay, I'm going to put that in the window. Just to make sure. Yeah, the correct name would be nice. That's if you have a problem and you can't log in. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Here's another one. If you sent in the last three weeks or four weeks, I don't care, items into me, that need to be ironed out or whatever, or to Julie, problems that you had, whatever it was, if you did, and that problem has been solved, please write Julie and say, Julie, this item I sent you about this, 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 simple, has been resolved. Thank you very much. That would be fantastic. Please, that would be fantastic because some of the problems are being, some of the items have been ironed out and we're not knowing that they were. That would save us a lot of time and headache. If you just said, we got it, thank you, no problem. That would be great. Um, okay, um, as Mr., a lot happened in the last couple of weeks. I'm going to try to, cut it down. We know that there's laser technology, some kind of laser technology with the data centers. And I briefly looked over it, briefly. But with laser technology involved, whatever the laser they're talking about, it can save big time on cost power consumption, from what I understand, but I could be wrong. The tech guys, O-Tech pros, will be educating on this, the educating us on this in we, the next couple of weeks. Not today, next couple of weeks. They have an agenda they're doing step by step that they were asked to do by Mr. Mufara. But they will address this because it's a big deal. And by the way, we don't need to know. It doesn't change anything. This is just 
educational. You don't need to know. You know what Ash needs from us? Loyalty, trust, patience, and help your fellow uh, members. <coughs> really, that's it. Have the face in the system. Trust they're going to guide us the right way. They know better. Don't compare this to anything else because there is no comparison. It's like trying to, you, you can't do it. You can't compare mom's meatloaf to somebody else's. It's the best. You can't, it's even more than that because it's not even meatloaf, okay? What what Mr. Mipar and his team are doing have never been done. Well, so-and-so did this and it took them, they did what? They didn't do what we're doing. Nobody's doing what we did. That's the plus. So don't compare. And don't think, well, we should do that. You don't even know what it is. A lot of people are thinking about, well, what about, don't worry about it. The view and the understanding from the crow's nest that Mr. Mufaro is in, he sees everything clearly. And he's guiding the ship. Trust them. Let's just do what we're expected to do, which is very little. His crew's running the engine. They're plotting the course. All we have to do is lay in lawn chairs in the back and soak in the sun. And trust we're going on a great journey. That's it. Not a lot to ask. And if this isn't for you, raise your hand. I want off. To, I want out. I don't want to go on this journey. I don't want to go over to the. The great place we could be. I want to get off. They'll put you on a dinghy. They'll send you back to land. Give me the ninety-seven dollars. Pat you in the butt and say see you later. There's no nobody has to stay. But if you're going to, have faith, have trust. The vision. And the guidance that they see, Mr. Mufar, from the crow's nest, thousands of feet above us, <coughs> knows where we're going, why we're going, everything. So don't worry about that. We get ourselves all flustered over stuff that doesn't matter. Yeah, but I think it doesn't matter what we think. We don't know. You can't have an opinion about something we don't know. We don't know. I don't know, you don't know, she don't know, we don't know. We know this. That's why I want you to watch that video about Ask Me Far. He's a class act. He's one in a million, one in a billion. And all we have to do is say, I trust you, Ash. I'm going to give you these pennies, $97 to go on the best journey of my life. I thank you so much for letting that ticket be so cheap. <coughs> <coughs> okay? Really, no joke. <coughs> <coughs> oh, man. <coughs> there we go. Sorry about that. Excuse me. But seriously, let's just have the faith. I've never wavered. Thank God. I've never had a day where I go, I don't think, never, not once, in three and a half years, not once. It got stronger, and I didn't know what I had. But even then, I knew it was something I never had before. I knew it's, if, it, if it could do for other people that I couldn't do, I could never bring anybody with me. Ash made it so that everybody goes together on the same cruise. The Unpassive Cruise is like no other cruise in the planet. Really, no doubt. We should all know that now. And, and for the next three weeks, while we're still bringing founders in, all I ask, all I ask is if you're going to invite somebody in, get them caught up. Make sure they know what they're in. 
You know what I mean? Make sure they know what we're in. And uh, I don't talk anybody into anything. Chris Johnson's doing a live after this. Tonight is uh, Ron and Lynn's live. I'm sure the tech guys will be there. I'll be there maybe a little late. Because in the beginning, I got movie night with my grandchildren and my wife. And we're going to do a movie right after dinner. But I will be there. I'll start it and all, but I'll be there. Richard Toxin, how you doing? But seriously, all we're asking is to have faith. Do we have faith? Yeah, we wouldn't be here. Some of us have been here even longer than me. But I'm over three and a half years. I'm not going nowhere. I would follow Ask Mephara anywhere, anytime. Never met anybody like him. And I've never met a group of people like you guys. Never. 18 years. 18 online. 25 years in a factory and I traveled the world. Never met a group of people like you guys. Never. Anywhere. Ever. You know why that is? Because of Ask Mephara. He said to me right in the beginning, you will bring people in who you are like. People will be drawn to you that are like you. And he's right. He's right. That's why people on the outside say, these people are nuts. They're all nuts. We are. We are. We're freaking cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. I don't care. Positive. Care about your fellow man. Somebody says, am I my brother's keeper? you damn right I am. We are. And if everybody thought that way, what would the world be like? I got mine, you get yours. What kind of crap is that? I want to be different. I've never been the same as everybody else. The same puts me in a position I don't want to be in. I don't want to be typical. I don't want to be average. And none of you are average. Ask your family. They think you're nuts. <laughs> Guarantee it. You got brothers and sisters and uncles and stuff. They think you're freaking cuckoo. But that's okay. That's okay. It's, it's, it's the ones that... That dared to think something could be. It's the ones that dared to think it's possible. That made the world change. Not a boatload of people. Handful of people in society from the from the day man stepped on the came on this planet. Handful that believed it's possible. And they took that extra step. Everybody called them a name until it worked. And now they want to be a friend. That's the way it is. Society's been that way forever. So who are you going to listen to? A broke guy tell you how to get how to how to change your life? Doesn't make sense. Everybody that says you're a dreamer, you're doing it wrong, you're an idiot. Do you want what they have in most cases? No. They just don't believe it's possible. And I believe if you can think it, it can be done. I really do. Always have. Always have. This company is as big and as bad as I thought it could be. But it's bigger and better than I thought it could be. So it just keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger. And every time I crack open or move a rock, I look underneath and it's bigger than it was than I thought. And I, another thing comes out, you, you dissect it, you go, oh, my God, that's even bigger than I thought. No wonder why Mr. Mappar is jumping all over his chair because he's in the crow's nest. He's got a very clear view of what's coming. And all he's yelling down to us is, trust me. What do we have to lose? He did all the work. 
Feminists finally sacrificed everything. What did we sacrifice? Being able to hang out with each other on Zooms for the last three years that in most cases he paid for? Everybody could reach their potential on a platform in a society called on passive that he started? Think about what we have and why we have it. And all we had to do is be there. You don't have to do any heavy lifting. You didn't even have to, didn't have to tighten one bolt. Not one nut, not one screw did you have to screw in to this massive ship. We did nothing. Didn't even swab the deck. Just sat in a lawn chair, soaking in the sun, waiting to get to the destination. Come on. Come on. That's all we got to know. That's all we got to know. And, and, and I believe our job, and I mean job. It's not a job, though, because it's in here. I believe our mission right now is to take people that may, might not see exactly what we do and pull them in tighter so that when we are introduced to the world, we're not only 1,300,000 people. We're 1,300,000 people that are going to make a difference. We enter with power, conviction and power. We enter this arena called the business world with power and uniqueness. Nobody ever did it. People will be sitting around conference room tables, colleges, universities. What the heck did they do? Who are they? How did they manage to do that? That's what they're going to be saying. Yep. Trust me, it's coming. Exactly what we think, even more so. So, help the people on the outside, bring them in tighter. Give them your glasses so they can see what you see. Because I tell you what, if you see what I see, and I don't see what he sees in the crow's nest, I don't, I can't. But man, I see enough. I feel enough. So, so please, let's all do the same thing. And you guys are magnificent. You all, you all deserve to be here. You, you all can reach your potential in life. I don't care how old you are, how sick you are. Listen, this fat behind got COVID a year ago, eight, nine months ago, with a lung problem, overweight. And I got through it. Why? God above. No doubt about it. And I think this movement on pastors is, is a blessing to mankind. How big it'll, how, how much it'll do, how, who cares? If I can help, if we help one person, if we all helped one person, we've now doubled it from 1,300,000 to 2,600,000. Help two. And those million help a million. What happens in a year's time, two years' time, three years' time? Pretty powerful. Anyway, I um, my phone is going to fall off the table. It's vibrating so much. Uh, let's keep the faith. Happy Friday. A lot of webinars over the weekend. Don't forget. Um, Ron and Lynn's um, live tonight. Open mic. They'll, they'll have the tech guys there. They have an agenda that they're supposed to do. It'll be great. I'll be there. Invite people there. It'll be shared. Um, but let's help each other. 
Samantha's here. Robin's sister. Hello. Great lady, too. Big John White, high and tight. There you are, John. Chris Johnson. Get ready for your live, Chris. Grab your jug of water, whatever it is you drink. I think it's whiskey, but what do I know? Anybody, anyway, everybody go over to Chris's, give him support. He's now on YouTube. I'll see you all. Thanks for your prayers. We've only just begun. You are all fantastic. Fantastic, fantastic. Don't worry about what your family says. They don't know anything. They'll love you later on. Trust me. Anyway, I'll see you all and God bless.